Hello Rafikis, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're joining me for the first time, I am Mitindi Jacobs. I do videos on home styling and home organization. If you're a returning subscriber, hello Rafiki, welcome back. Thank you for your patience. I know it's been a minute since I last posted, but it's just very difficult for me to do this, guys. With a new baby, with my businesses and everything that's going on, it's really difficult, but I do appreciate your patience and I do appreciate you guys coming back to watch my videos when I do post them. Today's video, I'm starting my countdown to Christmas. It's about 32 days left until Christmas and I'm starting to get into the Christmas energy, Christmas vibe and I'm going to start by showing you guys my favorite celebratory item, my drinks cart, my drinks trolley, how I decorate and style that to make it functional, user friendly and of course pretty because if you know me by now, everything's got to look pretty right. <laughs> so I'll be showing you guys how to style a drinks trolley. If you don't have a drinks trolley, you can use a table, you can use your console table, a dining table, wherever. You really just want a space where you can put all these things together so that your guests can serve themselves and also just to get everything in order so that people know exactly where to get what they need from you. So in celebration of Christmas, I'm going to be doing this followed by another video where I'm going to be showing you how to style my Christmas tree again. I did that last year, Komani touched that Christmas tree and it completely fell done so we'll be doing another video of that i also need to do my christmas shopping yeah so lots to do before christmas and then i'll also be showing you guys um my outfits my summer outfits that i'm gonna be wearing now that i'm a mom of two and i need to learn how to hide that fupa <laughs> it's tough you guys but yeah i really hope you guys enjoyed the video i'll start it off by showing you all the stuff that you need to decorate it and all the stuff that you need uh, basically on a drinks trolley all the stuff that you'll be making use of i hope you enjoy the video don't forget to sound down in the comments below if you've got any questions or any comments remember to like and subscribe it really helps my channel i appreciate each and every one of you and i'm looking forward to a wonderful christmas and i hope you guys are looking forward to it too ah. all right guys so i wanted to show you guys what my bar trolley or drinks trolley looks like and this is how it looks like i got this from at home I purchased it a couple of years back it's very vintage and I've got the uh, top layer as well as the bottom layer so that gives me a lot of space to work with so this is what I'm working with um, I think they still have a couple of them in stock that's my olive tree that's still doing very well there and this is not where I'm going to keep it I just put I just put it here because of the lighting the lighting is quite good over here and yeah so this is how it looks like uh, you can have a look at it home I think they've got a couple uh, a couple of them in stock maybe a different style but this is how mine looks like and I know Kenwin interiors is also going to start doing these so I'll link her profile her instagram profile again in my description just so that you guys can have a look at what she does so mine has little wheels so you can like wheel it around if you need to take it outside you need to take it inside you can wheel it around and i really like that and then it's just got a mirror over here which is nice for reflecting and yeah so this is how my cart looks like so over here this is basically all the items that i'm going to be having on that cart uh, i start with my glassware so I'm going to be serving three types of drinks, actually four types of drinks on that cart. Uh, I've got wine glasses for the red wine. I've got these glasses for water. I've got these for the whiskey. It's actually cognac. And then I've got these for the gin. I like to drink my gin from these. And also, I think they just tie in nicely with the other glassware. And then this is just a jug, basically a crystal jug that's good for mixing. And then I've got some glass straws over there. I've got some edible flowers, some lemons, some cherries. And then I've got this uh, gin infusion kit. It's basically got all these dried fruits and herbs that you basically use into your um, infuse into your gin to give it some flavor and then i've got all my accessories over here my spoons uh the stuff that you use to mix with this is the thingy that you use to i think if you're like maybe trying to squash something or to get maybe flavor out of lemon this is what you use i don't know what it's called and then this is it like a tot glass or something i don't know what the names are for these things so please pardon me and then i've got this a mixer i've got my ice bucket and then over here i've got the drinks that i'll be serving on the cart. on the cart i've got this is cognac i've got my water i've got my red wine i've got my gin and then i've got some soda water so the idea is basically just to put all of these 
together in a cohesive manner in a manner that makes sense in a manner that looks nice and then i also need to get some flowers to just style it and make it look pretty so let's get started really just play around with what you have and see how it looks like and it must sort of be functional so you'd want to put like your wine glasses together with the wine and all that so i'm going to start by using a tray i like to use a tray just to anchor everything together it always just looks good to group things together in a tray it just flows better in my opinion and i'm going to start with this bottle this is a remy martin cognac fine champagne darling nice such a gorgeous bottle I'm going to use that and then I've got the glasses for the cognac that I'm going to put over here right with it and then I'm going to take the water the wine I think I'm going to put these down here Ooh. bless you baby and then I've got my ice bucket that I'm also going to put down here and the mixer I'm also going to put it down here then I've got another tray, just a glass tray, that I'm going to put over here. I think I'm going to move this over here. Um, these are just little, so just a little plate with the edible flowers, the lemons and stuff. I'm going to put this over here. And this. basically how everything turned out i changed it up a little bit i changed the tray that was gold here i felt like the gold was too much so i changed it into this wooden looking one and i put some of the drinks up here that's how the top looks like and here's how the bottom part looks like i've got my waters there i've got my ice bucket i've got my shaker and then most of my glassware is up here together with my mixer and then I've got these dried oranges and dried apples, which are for the gin. So that's really how it looks like, guys. And yeah, and then I've got a towel over here in case anybody misses. And it's just a monogrammed towel, MJ, Matindi Jacobs. <laughs> and that's how it looks like. So this is how it looks like, guys. And then I basically just rolled it out to where my guests are seated. And then they can help themselves and treat themselves to whatever it is that they want over here. Um, and then of course, as the bottles empty, you refill them and all that. And yeah, I added my flowers just for the touch of nature and just to make it cute. That's how it looks like. leftovers that I have from shooting my video to make icebox flavor ice box. So these are done. I'm just gonna pop these into the fridge and they're going to come out to be so beautiful. This one doesn't have that. Mm -hmm. 